pretty easy to say that historically, but actually what we had was the first universal male education in Europe. It's a, a little distinction that isn't often made, but I think is, is worth making. But education is something that we've had for a very long time. We had four universities when England still only had two. And the third, fourth, fifth and sixth oldest universities in the world are in the English speaking world are right here in Scotland. Education is important. Education is uh, something to be valued, and I hope you'll find out about that as part of the political history. And just as my own little part of political history is part of the uh, <coughs> SNP, the historic SNP victory this year in the Scottish Parliament elections, I'd just like to say again uh, congratulations on the grant, and uh, I wish you the best of luck with this course. Thank you. for Scottish culture and Scottish history as I've become older. Because I understand, when I understand history, I understand that I actually am connected to everyone here. The history has connected me. And uh, I want to just the history of your place. And then I'll make connections. So I've been doing a little bit of research. How many people here from Bangladesh Okay. Yeah, <laughs> okay, so Bangladesh is now the jute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jute, jute mill, yeah. That's the jute mill. Adam G, you know the Adam G jute mill? Adam G jute mill, yeah. Adam G jute mill. So the Adam G jute mills. I have a photograph which I'll show you yeah. of a man called Mackenzie from Dundee. Yeah. yeah, they've been to the trip and uh, Dundee and there. Oh, you went to Dundee and all that stuff. Okay, so I've got a beautiful photograph of Mr. Adam G and Mr. Mackenzie <laughs> yeah. standing outside the Adam G uh, <coughs> jute mills. And of course, what was happening there was that in the, in the end of the 18th century, 
the East India Company, yeah. took jute to Dundee. Dundee, yeah, yeah. And all through the 19th century, all of the jute in the world, most of it was made in Dundee. <coughs> the interesting thing about what you could not make jute in Dundee without whales. So you need to catch whales to get the whale oil to process the jute. Okay, so that's, and this photograph shows the transfer of information from the, from Scotland to Bangladesh. Yeah. And uh, so that was my first connection that I thought about as I came in here. Since we are connected. Thank you for giving us the time. And thank you for the time. Thank you for the time.